And, uh, you know, you, you expect me to say something about the employee retention tax credit. Um, those returns are alive and kicking. OK, give us a shout if, you're, if you've got any question about that, because the ERC is not going away for another year and a half. Well, till April. Right. So uh, so figure, well, a year and a quarter anyway. Right. It's not going away. It's still out there. And the IRS is like, oh, we don't like the ERC. Yeah, tough noogies. You know, there's a lot of things I don't like about my job, uh, except meeting all you wonderful people. That's a, that's a part I like. But there are parts I don't like. And IRS is like, oh, we don't want to process these because uh, they're difficult. Yeah, no kidding, they're difficult. I got it. Understood. We've, we've done over 7,500 of these things. They're not easy. They're not. seventy. Well, it's more than that. But it's probably uh, because we I figure average of three quarters out of six, right? So I'm I, I'm on the low side. So that's twenty one, twenty two thousand individual returns that we file. Twenty two thousand. That's a lot of returns. You know, I mean these nine forty one X's. Uh, but it's still out there. It's still real. It's it hasn't gone away. You know, and the IRS is like, oh, well, we don't want to do that anymore. We, well, okay, I get you don't want to do it anymore. The fact of the matter is taxpayers are continuing to send them in. They had a 600, get this, they had a, this, this just shows you, they had a 600,000 case backlog, right? 600,000 files, right, that had come in, and they were like, this is back in September, and they're like, oh, we're not going to do this anymore. This is too hard. And... What do you think people say? You know, we're going to do a moratorium. We're going to work on what we got, but we're not going to work on any new stuff. Well, it's not like they could until January. It's like, well, you got enough in the old stuff to keep you going until March. So don't even tell me about January. I know if I file now, you're not even going to look at it until sometime in March. So now you're telling me, oh, well, we won't look at it until fe- until January. It's like, what? You already weren't going to look at it. What are you talking about? And since then, here's the, here's the other interesting thing that they they let fall, I don't know, maybe a few weeks, maybe a month ago, was that uh, there have been another three or 400,000. You can't really tell because they don't tell you. You have to deduce from the numbers that they do give you. You have to infer. But there's another three, 400,000 new filings have been made. Okay? So when people tell you, oh, that's uh, yesterday's news. Oh, there's no more money for small business. Oh, we just have to, you know, suck it up with this stupid inflation and everything else. All right. Oh, there's no, there's, you know, yeah, we got invited to the kids table. You know, that's what happened. Small business got invited to the kids table. And now they're saying, oh, well, we don't want, oh, you showed up at the kids table and you actually want dessert. Uh, I'm sorry. You know, we're saving all that for big business, not that, not those small businesses and trying to shut the door. on you. Well, what, what? Anyway, if you uh, if you run a business, if you're wondering and you haven't, even if you've applied once already, because there's a lot of ins and outs on this thing, you got to do it correctly. And most most people, frankly, haven't. Um, but if you do it correctly, it's a it it can be a very nice a very nice spiff. Keep your business going, right? Now that you have figured out how to work in this, you know, where we have a victim of senile dementia as a president and inflation going crazy and all the rest of this stuff. That's a new world. You haven't, we haven't been there before, right? Get a few bucks from the government back, refund, you know, get a few bucks of refund just to tide you over and then keep your business going. I and mean, why not? <laughs> 